What's up, guys? It's me, your pet ass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Alpha Sapphire walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we came into the east side right here of Route 118, and uh, we stumbled across Steven Stone. Not only that, but we got ourselves a Latias because, well, it trusts us. It loves us. And, uh, yeah, we got ourselves a Mega Stone, too. Mega Stone, Mega Key, or keystone yeah that whole stuff we're about to destroy people anywho um uh, since i sent lanoon back to the pc yeah I, I'm, I'm going to need to <laughs> I, I need to uh yeah <laughs> whatever so we have just achieved something pretty great right here guys and that is a continuation of this new storyline and you know i Eventually, we're going to have to start, like, switching up some Pokemon here and there, which is still the plan. And as you guys can see, we're we're definitely looking at some trainers, new Pokemon and all that stuff. And I did not see you. Take flight, my bird Pokemon. Hmm. Okay. Alrighty. So, here we go. Taking on Bird Keeper Chester. Huh. Bird Keeper Chester. Alright, bring it on. So, let's go right ahead. And explore. And just talk about a little, f uh, a few things here. Okay, so yes, I am uh, planning on changing up a few things on the team. Try out some new stuff. You know, be a little surprising and all that stuff. And now that we are allowed to like locate people's, um, locate people's secret bases and all that crud, which will help us in our training. I, I'm pretty sure I can get them up to level before or what our sixth badge. Oh yeah, we're gonna have a much fluid team, and well. Let's go with a discharge attack right here. And, well, Swellow, you ain't feeling that good anymore, right? No. He is not feeling that great. Alrighty, okay. And just like that, we win again. Okay. So, before we go up north, we are going to be taking our... Oh, wow, we're going to... I probably should... I probably should put on some repels because we will be finding some Pokemon around here that, you know, we probably never, ever, 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 ever cat caught or something like that. And I don't want to battle Pelipper because, well, that's 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 not that's not a good idea. So, let's go right ahead and battle her. My hobby is a Pokemon. Amy, or is Pokemon Amy? What? You got something to say about it? No, I'd never say anything about it, but okay. All right. So here we go, taking on a delinquent, and her name is Miley, not so Cyrus, and well, let's go. Let's go ahead and see what we got right here. Um, Blaze Kick, that usually works. And, uh, well, look at that. Look at that, okay, alrighty, so that, that looks pretty easy right there. And, uh, well, let's go ahead and take on a Mighty Anna. So we're just going to continue on right here with good old Tommy JDF. And thankfully, this Pokemon does not have Intimidate. So this right here will become a lot easier for us. And just like that, easy. Oh, yes. Easy, easy money. And bam, Olay grows to level 41. Thunderball to level 43. Shadow Eye to level 34. It wants to learn Zen Headbutt. Now, this is a good move right here. The only problem is... Well, there is no problem. Hmm. Yeah. 70. Um... 80. Okay. You know what? I can always, I can always teach it my facade anytime I want. It is what it is. Okay, so... We'll do that. And Miley has been defeated. So, let's go right ahead. And take a look at what Route 123 is going to offer to us. Now, there is a bit of a difference in Route 123. That is, the amount of the amount of berries that you'll locate right here. It is ridiculous. Plus, it's raining. So, that is a huge advantage for Olay right here. What we're going to do is, we're actually going to be switching it up to Gaia the Fierce Knight. And, uh, we're going to be going right here first. This is the berry person's house, I think. And if you talk to this person, he's gonna be like, "Do you do you know Gra Gra Gracidia or Gra Gracidia? In the Sinnoh region, people give a bouquet to Gracidia to convey their gratitude. It's a very old custom. Gracidia is that a Pokemon? You may call me the Berry Master. I dream of filling the world with beautiful flowers, so I raise berries and hand them out to everyone. You're deserving of one. 
And there we go. We get ourselves a Nomel Berry and a Corn Berry. Not bad. Okay. Alrighty. So let's go right ahead and talk to this lady. And she's going to be like, the way my husband grows berries. Oh, he's the best in the world. He makes me proud that he does. Incidentally, child, do you know a good saying? What was uh, that saying? It's uh, something battle. I, I wonder what that kind of battle it was. Hmm. I don't know. Pokemon battle? Let's see. I'm, I'm just, I'm just like, you know. I'm just, uh, you know, paraphrasing right here. We'll see what happens. And there we go. It's Pokemon. I'm just going to put it like that. And she's going to be like, oh, good scene. Uh, it's you're quite remarkable i want you to have this and there we go we got our, we grab ourselves a lumberry which yes that right there will help us out and well we got a battle ready for us and she's ignoring us good times are filled with good aromas mm-hmm okay so here we are taking on aroma lady violet and she's coming out with her vile plume this pokemon right here looking like a you know, it's looking like a pretty formidable opponent, but we do have the psychic attack, so that right there is going to take care of uh, Vileplume itself, and just like that, we win. Yeah, I really wish I had the speed button right here, because this, this would have been so much easier. And look at that, we get ourselves to level 39, and Tommy JDF, growing levels like crazy. I am guaranteeing you by the time we get to the Pokemon League, it's going to be bad. Super bad. Like the movie. Now here we're grabbing this, and here we found ourselves in Ultra Ball. Definitely something uh, we could use. And we go up north right here. You'll be able to find yourself this person. You know, I'm watching it. My cute little berries grow up uh, all springy and nice. They're just too cute to resist. Take as many as you like. Use them to grow even more berries. And well, when he means he's got a lot of berries, oh man, he's got a lot of berries. So. Yeah, this is the reason to why I, I, I swear to God, I, I wish I had the I, I wish I had the speed button right here because oh my god. There's a lot of berries here. Like a butt crack ton. Like so much it's ridiculous. Like these berries look like a lot, but they're just it's just one berry after another. And I'm only guessing that they did this just to make more of an emphasis when you're trying to like grow your Pokemon and stats when it comes to contests and all that stuff, so... I mean, that's cool, but when have you guys ever seen me do any kind of contests and all that? Not a lot. Plus, it's, uh... Well, I've never even tried the game right here, so I wouldn't know. And here we have quite a few. There's two more. So, the regular ones you'll find multiples of. And here we got Figgy Berries. There you go, Figgy Berry for the win. And here we go, come on, Wiki Berry. Kind of sounds like Wikipedia. And there you go, Wiki Berry for the win. And no, I do not want to plant any berry. None whatsoever. I haven't even used the berry yet. So there we go. And bam. Okay, alrighty. So there's some Mago Berries. Grab these. And there you go. And let's finish it off right here with Iapapa. Or the Iapapa. Iapapa. Hmm. How to pronounce it? Iapapa. Okay, so here we are moving on just a little bit further. And yes, berries. All the way. God dang it. All the way. Holy buckets. Okay. Grabbing this one. And there we go. And then a, a Pacho berry. Don't even know what that is. And we're grabbing this one. And Wacom Berries. Man, there's this guy was not kidding about it. He was not kidding about these berries. So, yeah, we're going to take our nice sweet time. So, how are you guys doing? I've been recording nonstop. And, uh, yeah, the, the goal is to 40 episodes. Currently, it is currently, what was it called? July 4th, America Day. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> Taking my nice day off in order for me to you know be ahead of the curve when it comes to when it comes to the Pokemon recordings right here of Pokemon Oraz and it's looking like to me that yeah we'll, we'll have a nice month worth of episodes that way you guys can actually you know 
can be satisfied with with the episodes and whatnot. Um, I don't know when this episode will pop up. Maybe after my birthday. But it is my birthday month, guys. And if the birthday has already passed, comment down below. How old do you think I, I am? I think I've already revealed it. I think I've already said it. I don't know. I probably did. I don't even know. So here we go. Habomberry. Of course, I am saying some stuff right here. And there you go. Just like that. And let's go ahead and move on. And I've, I've officially taken all your berries, homeboy. Giggity. And, well, I think there is one more trainer or trainers that you have to play. And, uh, oh, yeah, there's definitely quite a few trainers right here. So let's go right ahead and battle them all because, well, who doesn't love Pokemon battles? And this girl right here is like, fairy types are sure enough cute, but they, are, they can be strong too. I bet you already knew that, eh? And there we go. We get ourselves one of the most powerful fairy type moves, and that is Dazzling Gleam. There's no fairy type gym in Hoenn, eh? Maybe I'll sure enough go ahead and make one before Miss Valerie even gets here. I wonder who Valerie is. Maybe we'll find out pretty soon here. Okay, so let's get this double battle going. Alrighty, so here we go. Taking on Mew and Yuki. And they're going to be coming out with their dust talks and beautifully and as you guys can see yes we got our team right here ready to go let's get it uh draining kiss that is not gonna do anything let's go with that and i know that it's well i know that it's raining but we could do this so there we go blaze kick and no the rain does not save it from that one and well let's see come on there it is, and that right there is how you do things. Alrighty. Okay, alrighty. So that right there, we get some more points. And we have defeated Mew and Yuki. That's right. You didn't like that. <laughs> okay, so I'm sure she's talking about the Valerie the gym leader. If there even is a Valerie gym leader. So let's go right ahead and come back to Route 118. And before we do anything, guys, I kind of want to—I kind of want to do something off screen. So I'll be right back with you guys. Alrighty, guys. So we're back, and well, I just needed a bit of a, bro a bathroom break. So let's go right ahead and switch up our Pokemon right here, and uh, take care of everything else, like battling everybody. Bird Pokemon in fl uh, that fly elegantly in the sky—they are the best. You would think so. So, here we go, take it on, Bird Keeper Perry, and he's going to be coming out with his Pelipper right here, and, well, that is a quad damage right there for Thunderball, so let's go and finish this guy off right here with a simple Charge Beam for, for the win. Look at this, Charge Beam does its trick, holy crud, and there goes Pelipper. Yeah, it didn't like it, didn't like him. So, Latias, without doing anything else, yeah, it... it it literally just gained a level. We're not really going to Mega Evolve anything right now because, well, shoot. I think I should save it for, like, later battles or something like that. Like, a very, very tough battles. Which, as many of you guys can see, not everybody here is a tough battle. So, yeah. And, well, there we go with the Citrus Berry. Here's another Citrus Berry right here. And, well, let's see. Let's go right ahead and grab this little sucker. And there we go. We got, well, three pairs of citrus berries. Let's go and move on just a little bit further. And let's see. Let's go away from that. There is an item right there waiting for us. And before we do anything, I don't want to get attacked anymore by any of these Pokemon. So let's see. Let's go right ahead. Let's go right ahead and use a Super Repel. Just to help us out right here, and let's see. The Pokemon that's located, or the, the Pokemon that's hiding from us, is right in the big old bushy area right there, which I guess you could say it's pretty hilarious and all that. And, uh, well, let's see. Anything else? Nope, that's pretty much. Oh, you know what? Let's go ahead and take a look at what kind of Pokemon we're talking about right here. So, I'm looking, and going slow. That's not the Pokemon. 
Where the heck is that Pokemon? Oh, wow, it's the opposite way. Huh. Okay, so that was a complete failure. Let's go ahead and talk to this guy. He's going to be like, thanks to a rune dude, I've been awakened to the adventure that is building a secret base. He said that he would be waiting for me with the secret base guild, but Fortree City is far away. Hmm. You don't say. So, anywho, guys, we're going to pause it right here. In the next episode, we're going to be going through the whole route of uh, Route 119 and everything. And we're gonna see we're gonna see how we're gonna see how everything goes. There's gonna be some captures. There's gonna be a lot of fun things going on. I cannot wait to go through this whole area. So thank you guys again for watching. I will see you guys in the next episode as we continue our adventure right here. See you guys.